Welcome to part two of our Southeast Colorado trip. I'm Philip Watson with Discover Wilderness. Get him in the sun. I wonder what kind of grasshopper that is. Oh, that thing's giant. Yeah, I've never seen one this big. There. Try to stay out of its light. This is the Plains Lubber Grasshopper. It is by far the heaviest grasshopper I have ever held. You never know what you'll find when you get out and discover wilderness. Look at this, looks like a nice piece of armor on its neck. Part of the grasshopper that I'm referring to is called the prothorax. Oh, you can see the, there's his mouth there. The lubber grasshopper is an omnivore that eats plants and other insects. Like you can see the little hooks on its feet. Something neat about these grasshoppers is they were used in early genetics research due to their large chromosomes. Unfortunately, it was too windy to hear what I said at this part, so I will try my best to do a voiceover of what I was talking about. This is a male juniper, and this is a female juniper. The female juniper produces small blue berries. These berries are what gives gin its flavor. There's a praying mantis. They come in a lot of different colors. This guy's a brown, blends real well into the dead grasses here. Not a bad size one. Oh, he's looking at me. Now watch how his head moves. These insects can turn their heads 180 degrees. Let me see his. Okay, let me try to zoom in. Okay. All right, let's see if we can get him to look at the camera. Oh. Scratching at you? Yep. I think he's just trying to find grip. The praying mantis is a predator and a cannibal. Sometimes the females will eat the males after mating. Get it to fly away. Maybe not. Usually the mantis will stay still waiting until its prey is within striking distance.
They have an elongated abdomen and two long front legs used for grabbing prey. These creatures have a short lifespan, usually under a year. Thanks for watching this episode of Discover Wilderness. Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can see more videos as they come out.